Hey guys, so today we're going to do a quick um, uh, sort of text reveal um, with uh, Adobe Premiere. This is, uh, this is a pretty simple um, thing, much like we did before we did the transition. Um, we're going to have a word appear seemingly out of thin air, or it was seeming as if it's been sort of revealed by virtue of like the motion behind um, something. So uh, I'm going to pull this little cup of coffee out here, which uh, you, you should be able to find if you go to pixabay.com and just search coffee. But you can do this with any kind of thing, so long as what you're looking at is sort of like moving out of the way. So for instance, we're looking at this coffee cup. The idea here is I want this coffee cup to move out of the way and then this word coffee to be kind of revealed here. So I'm going to have this text tool right about here as soon as the coffee goes out of the screen here. I'm going to... Um, I might actually have it be um, uh, towards the beginning, but I'm going to type it out here. Coffee. Let's look here. And I'm going to make it a little bit nicer looking. So obviously you want to make sure you change the font to something other than um, Adobe Caslon or Minion Pro or whatever uh, the um, first uh, you know uh, thing is. Let's see. I think I want to find this. So it looks nice. Sunrise International. It looks good. Uh, maybe more like um, Skywalker is nice too. I could sort of put capital C. It looks better. Oops. Yeah, like that. Okay. Um, and I'm gonna make this a bit bigger. I'll just use this right here. And because this is uh, white on white, I'm gonna add a stroke to it. Actually, I'm gonna add a shadow. There we go. That looks nice. Um, Stroke's fine. Maybe like a black stroke. And I can pick it up a little bit. All right. All right, good. So whatever it is that you want it to uh, look like, obviously it's up to you. Um, as this kind of comes, I'm gonna move this. I'm gonna move this back and have this extend past the entire entire thing here. So I'll have like coffee right there. So you can see what uh, kind of envision what I'm looking for. I'm looking for essentially. Um, this to be totally obscured by, a, you know, totally invisible. And then as the coffee cup moves away, I want it to reveal. So it, it can't be bigger than the coffee cup, um, and it can't, um, it can't extend past where, where the coffee cup goes. So whatever text you put um, for whatever's moving, you want to make sure it's, it's kind of hanging out there. So um, with this uh, coffee selected, I'm going to grab my under opacity here. I'm going to grab my mask. And I'm just going to draw a simple um, mask around the coffee right there. And um, that should get invisible. Let's look here. Can we invert? There we go. All right, so it's inverted. So now it's totally uh, invisible uh, until I move this out of the way. So I'm going to go ahead for my mask path, and I'm going to start putting in some keyframes here. So same deal as before. Uh, I'm going to um, basically just like hold down shift and press uh, the forward button, and I can just kind of keep adding these keyframes here. Actually, I'll just put it right about there. Let's see if I can just um, move this out of the way. I'll click on my mask path here. I'll move it just slightly out of the way. All right, so that, that, that's about that's about where we want it to go. Um, and I'll just once again shift, move over. Okay, not quite. Shift, move over. Okay, here we go. And so this is where we want to actually sculpt our mask around our coffee cup. So in this case, I'm just going to grab uh, one of these um, right here, and I might actually just make another point, bow this out until it takes the shape of the coffee cup. And so in this case, once again, shift, click forward, and I can just sort of move down to fit along with that. Shift, forward. Again, move this around to where it fits here. Shift forward. All right. Almost done. Shift. In this case, I might just go forward one more. Here we go. And then we can um, probably just stop it there. So just to kind of take a look at what we've got going on. All right, that looks great. All right, it's pretty simple stuff. So you just need to find a clip off of uh, Pixabay or um, somewhere, um, just not YouTube, find some place, and just have a, uh, have a text reveal wherein you see some, some word appear just behind um, something that moved. All right, and then here there's, a, there's another thing up here um, where perhaps like this uh, thing gets 
fold out of the way. Maybe we could even have another word revealed. Yeah, that's fine. All right. So I'll just keep it there. Okay, so uh, uh, like I said before, um, just find a clip, find, uh, and then to determine what kind of text you want to put in there, and um, just have it revealed as the as it moves out of the way. All right, well, very cool. Can't wait to get us produce. Export that as an MP4.